Hey guys, how's it going? It's Duncanian and welcome back to Overcoach. So, hold on a second so I can hear myself think. We are going over a Lucio player today, a silver 1686 rated Lucio player from the PS4. And this is the first one that I've had sent in that's a YouTube video. So this is from a couple of months back. And so, meta's slightly different, things are slightly different. And I actually have, we're on board with the, that one, Ginger. And I actually have another VOD from this person coming up a little bit later down the line. Where we see that they've improved from where they are here. So it is very interesting. Obviously, you can see the UI is a bit screwed. Now, the UI had a problem, on, especially on console, I think, in the early days of the replay viewer, because uh, it used to screw up with what they call the safe zone on, on consoles, where you um you can adjust where the UI elements are. So yeah, I think that's why that's screwed. But it is fi it's fine, we, we got the information we need. So, what is that crosshair? <laughs> I have never seen that before. Hmm, okay. Um, so, Lucio on Rialto. I think we all know what happens here, don't we? So, let's see how aggressive you are. Let's see how Reddit you are. I've been warned that it's possibly quite a Reddity. So, are we capable of wall climbing, uh, wall climbing, uh, wall riding nicely? Seems we've got it fairly okay. We're gonna look for the boop here on the bridge, as per usual. No, we're not. We're going round. Where are we going? No. <laughs> so what do we see there? Let's just look at the team comps a second. So we're the green team. So we have the Rhine, the Genji, the Roadhog, the McCree, and the Batiste. Batiste was more powerful on this patch, I think, as well. And then they have a Junkrat, a Soldier, uh, Moira, Zen, Zarya and Hog. Zarya and Hog. Okay. There's a Roadhog there. We don't want to be here. He should turn and hook us and we should die immediately. He's not going to because this is Silver, unfortunately, and he's a bit Papega. But this this is a no-no. This is an absolute no-no. We don't go doing this. We, we don't go doing this. We should die here immediately. That is crazy stuff. That is way too risky. We wall, wall ride across here, boop here. You got one and then you get out. That's all you do. You don't go doing crazy stuff like coming in from the back like that. You are too far up on this area. You're, you're front lining too much. Way too much. You're putting yourself at a very big risk. Again, no, 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 no. You are 3 HP. You are 3 HP. You are very lucky to get out of there. Very, very lucky. Right, so our hog's dead, so we don't really want to get too aggressive. We don't want to front line. We, we don't... That's going big. Ay, 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 ay. You won't get away with that at higher levels. You just won't get away with that at higher levels. They are just... They're not paying attention to you at all. Which is stupid. So you have beat now. Let's see how you use it. Again, we're going too aggressive and we've had to use the beak, otherwise we're dead. So, you've cost yourself your beat there, if you see what I mean, from getting too aggressive. Because that was not a fight in which we need, we should have used, used beat. Because we, we weren't under enough pressure, but we put ourselves under pressure. Again, we're doing it. She's gone off. They're not learning from the mistake, are they? Ah, I hate it when people don't learn. She's going. Oh no, she's not. Hands got her anyway. Ay, 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 people don't learn. It's so ridiculously stupid. You, you're too far forward, though. You are too far forward. I understand that you're rolling them at this point and they're probably tilting the F out anyway. That's two big picks when there's end. Look what's happened. We need to we need to be careful here. Then I'll try and go big. Uh, only in silver. Maybe in bronze, actually. Let's, 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 not, let's not make assumptions here. So you need to fall back. You're with your Rhine. You're healing your Rhine. That's good. That's good. That's good. We need to fall back here. Where are we going? Where are we going? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. We were losing that fight anyway. We decided to go super, super aggro to try and 
get a crazy boop off like we got earlier. We're being way too red at Lucio here. And we used the beat on ourselves to keep ourselves alive. No one on our team has got that beat. Our Reinhardt is almost dead. Our Hog is not very healthy either. Look at the ults the other team has. We're clearly not tracking the ults. They have got a Junkrat tire. They have got the Grav. Your beat should have been saved to counter that Graviton Surge. So you have now cost your team an ultimate that could have negated their ultimates and therefore you've given them a fight winning opportunity. You can't do that. You just can't do that. Looking at the length of this VOD, it probably doesn't matter. But at higher levels, you cannot do this. You are being way too aggressive. You are using beat to save yourself, which is not an ideal use of that ultimate. The drop the beat from Lucio is incredibly, incredibly powerful. What are we doing? What are we doing? Are we hoping they're going to walk around and we're going to move them all off? <sighs> look at our team. The quality is not brilliant. I can understand that. But look at what... You don't need the quality to see what's happening here. There. Yeah, let's not do that. Dead. 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 Low. Low. That's yourself low, by the way. And he's not in, in, that healthy either. Ultimate, ultimate, ultimate. What are we doing? What are, what are we doing here? We should be getting out. What is our Reinhardt doing up there? Oh, don't tell me. Oh, no, 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 no. He's going to shatter, isn't he? Oh, my God. No, that's a four. Man. He killed the Zen. He kills the Moira. This fight gets turned, doesn't it? You're dead. It says 16 player kill streak, but that isn't good. Because you have literally been a DPS Lucio this entire time, pretty much. And that will cost your teams very, very dearly at a higher level. You cannot be like this. You're playing Lucio like a DPS. My DPS have got really good picks here. We, we are lucky. We are very, very, very lucky. They still haven't used Grav. They... They've got Tire, Grav, and, and, and Visor, and they're, they're not using it. What are they doing? She's... She's gonna... She's gonna go the whole round without using that Grav. And the... And the Tire. It doesn't get used. What? No, no, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, goodness me. This is not me doing this. This is a personal business. Um. <sighs> that team let you get away with murder. At, 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 truly murder. You should not have got that many boots. You should have not been able to play around in their backline like that all of the time. At gold, you will get punished for that. At platinum, you'll get punished for that. And above that, you will get reported. I I'm being honest. And I, I know that sounds harsh, but I'm being honest. It's okay to go for the occasional boot, but all you were doing were DPSing there. And that's really not good. And using the beat to save yourself... Both times you use the beat to save yourself. Okay, so we're up against a Bastion comp here. So, I know exactly what you're doing. You're going to go and try and boot them off the high ground. I can see that they have got... Okay, now the Aris has died, actually. But the barrier might still be up and they have Rhine. We've got good picks here. We can't boop a Bastion while he's in sentry mode. And you boot into an Orisa barrier, so you didn't boot the Reinhardt either. We need to get out. As soon as that boot doesn't work, you need to get out. Straight away. Because we just because the Reinhardt left his post and he shouldn't have chased after you. He should have just swatted you away, but he shouldn't have chased after you. As soon as he left the post, the Hanzo was free to shoot on the Bastion. 
So the distraction was there, but and that's a nice. I actually like that boot if you go straight back because you're boot to, you've booted them outside of their barrier. So now your team can do damage to them. That's a good kill on them. So now you need to actually you can stay you can stay here. Yeah, that, that aggression is okay. It's not too bad. What are we doing? Where are we going? So again, we can't boot a sentry mode bastion. <laughs> we can't do that. He 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 sticks wherever he goes. We shouldn't be doing this. This bastion should kill us instantly. He should just completely obliterate us. What are we doing? This is not good. He completely ignored you. He's stupid. He could have killed you on the spot. The Hanzo did it for him, but... Okay. So, I'm being really harsh here, but... You, you, you've got to see that your aggression is way too much way way too much you cannot go face to face with a sentry mode bastion like that any decent any decent bastion will just turn and pump you full of bullets and you will be dead the two beats you have used in this match have both been to save yourself and i believe they've only got one other person during those beats and your aggression, you, you're way too aggressive. And you, you're costing your team at times. There's no peel. Absolutely no peel. You're not looking after your other support. It wasn't necessarily needed in this match, but I, you need to do that at times. If you're playing with an Ana, you need to know that if she's got someone on her, your boop is the most precious thing to her because you can help her. The same with a Mercy or someone like that. You can help them out so, so much. You need to remember that. Your boop is not just an offensive, I'm going to get uh, environmental kills thing. It is a, a very good ability at not only getting kills, but getting getting people off of your backline. Lucio is incredibly good at peeling. Uh, the same can be said for Brigitte. They are very often used in the same way. So, the, the great thing about Lucio is he has the speed boost to engage as well. But we we haven't used, there was no team play from you. That, that, if I'm being brutally honest, there was no team play in this. You were full Reddit Lucio, I'm going for boops, I'm going for kills, I'm going for flashy plays. And that is silver low gold and it won't get you any further. And I think this is probably, I think you've sent this in because this is because of those boot kills. Because of that 4k, because of the, the so many boops you've got. And the boots, yeah, you got them because you were in the position to get them. But you also got them because the enemy team was ignorant and they didn't respect what you were doing. Any other team, especially a little bit higher than this, it'll happen once and they'll think, right, there's a Lucio, he's going for the Reddit plays, we need to be aware of this. And it wouldn't have happened again. But this team, this enemy team, was ignorant and they didn't respect it. And so you were allowed to run Riot in their backline and boop them off, get ridiculous kills, and just play Reddit the entire time. This is not the way to play Lucio. And I know this has been a really, really harsh one. It's been a short one as well. But this is not the way to play Lucio. Lucio, you can go a little bit aggressive sometimes. We've seen some aggressive Lucios even at the very, very highest level. But nothing like this. This is Lucio in the DPS category, pretty much. Lucio, good Lucios, can read the game. They know when to speed boost. They know when to heal. They know when to be with their team. They know when they've got the the scope to just get that little cheeky boop every now and then. And they know when to peel for their other support. And we saw, all we saw was you... I'm going to go for boops. I'm going to get the big play. I'm going to get the big play. I'm going to get the big play. So, yeah. That's that's my summary of that. I'm hoping when I see your next VOD that it's going to be much, much better. Much, much more interesting. But, I don't want to say this wasn't interesting. But this was an example of a, a very, 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 very aggressive Lucio. And it is not brilliant. And just rein it in. I'm not saying you can't go for aggressive Reddit Lucio plays. Sometimes they work, especially on Rialto. You can do it once, you can maybe do it twice. 
but you can't keep doing it like you were because you were abandoning your team. And going face to face with a sentry mode bastion like that, he should eradicate you. He should wipe you off the face of the planet. It was bad play from the bastion. It was bad play from the enemy team not to counteract what you were doing on the bridge. They didn't respect you and you got value out of it. That's where I'll go with that. But I don't want to be too harsh and I can't wait to see what your next VOD has in store because it should be really interesting and I want to see how much has changed between this VOD and that one. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, give a like, subscribe if you're new and I'll see you in the next video. See you then.